aunque yo sea guajiro natural. Welcome, one more time to this channel, Sell a Cigar Behind the Scene. In this channel, we're going to speak about the Cuban process in all factories. The same process uh, we use here in our leader company, Sera Cigars. So, in the last videos, we was speaking about La Moja el Despalillo. But today, we're going to speak about La Barajita. La Barajita is the name of one of the department in the factories in Cuba. But first, remember to subscribe in this channel so you're going to receive all notification. What they do in that department. All leaves need one specific level of moisture. So they, the employees in that, de, in that de, department, they have the responsive to give that moisture to all leaves. And also, they have the master blending. The master blending, he is the only one, remember that, he is the only one in the factory knowing all blending in the different cigars they made in the factories. Example, Coiba have one special blending, Montegristo have another special blending. So, what means when I say blending? Blending is the art to combine the flavors on the leaf. So, when you combine different flavors, example, Sela cigars, we combine the flavors with three different leaves from Brazil, Nicaragua, and Republica Dominicana. In Cuba, they do the same, but they take leaf from different uh, sites in the country, Pinal de Rio, Vuelta Abajo, etc. With all that leaf, they create the specific blending for Cohiba or the rest of cigars. And the master blending is the only one to know that blending in the, in the cigars. So, what happens after the master blending get all the leaf? The employees, we call it ligador. Lig, um, a ligador is the name of the employees uh, um, um, doing that job to separate all leaf. So after the master blending give the specific leaf for the cigars, they give moisture to that leaf and they put it in some racks. That leaf going to be there depending two years, one year into the factory. That process is before to that leaf coming to our hands, cigar rolling hands, to make the cigars. So all leaf need to be in that department for two or three years to get a really good, it's like a, a round, round. So a lot of people uh, in some places when on cigars are working, uh, some people ask me, so, so I like to smoke a, a fresh cigar. That is perfect. Everybody wants a fresh cigar. But really, cigars are better after a, re, a time. Six months, three months, depending on the brands. Some brands have more time in that department in the, in the racks and another brands have less time six months three months one year depending of the brand okay after that time 
in that department, la barajita. And after that, uh, the leaf going to la galera. Galera is the name where cigar roller are making cigars. And the leaf going straight to galera. Then uh, the boss in the galera, they tell to cigar roller what kind of cigar they going to do. The, uh, depending of the categories. But we're going to speak about that later. Okay, that was something uh, really interesting to know how they choose the specific leaf to make your cigars in the Cuban factories. We do the same here. In this case, our cigars, Sela cigars, have more than three months in La Barajita, o sea, we give the moisture to the leaf, then we leave the leaf for three months before to make the cigars. Okay, so in the next video, we're going to be in the basement. Remember, Sela Cigarette, we were in the basement. Next week, we're going to be in the basement and I'm going to do that process so you can see how is the process in real time. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this little video. Now you know more about the cigar process in the Cuban factory. And remember to subscribe this channel if you have some question you can you can ask in the in the comments i'm going to appre appreciate that have a good week and blessing blessing on blessing sell a cigars